Okay, this is the material for barometer. You need a bell, uh, balloon, jar, and two straw. If you have the only small one, it's okay. But for the straw, you need to make it one like this. Yeah, so the second one, you have to secure the straw so it will not move thin and it will not separate by using ah yeah, you can use the solar type here the longer the straw is the better one Boom. okay the second one you need to this is an aneroid barometer you need to cut this one to make the membrane for covering the gel like this yeah. make sure that it's uh, inflate like this one and secure it with the rubber band and secure it again with this one But actually, uh, I will set inflate it, but uh, make it flat first. And you have to piece your. This is like your arrow, yeah, in the center of your jar. This one, if there is a uh, pressure, it will be lower. If there is no pressure, it will be after like that one. In yeah, make sure that it's very very tight. Tighten the straw. Make sure that it's not moving. Actually, if you have glue gun, it's better you for you to use glue gun here, so it will be very very tight. On sale. Uh, if you have milk carton, it's better for you to use milk carton than make your own steel. Uh, for make your own steel, then make it from the paper like this one. So how to make it? Actually, if you make it by yourself, so you have to do like this one, like make a triangle. So that's why I, uh, I said that it's better for you to use like milk carton or something else that are like this, uh, able to stand up. Okay, you need this one for marking. This is the first position of your arrow. If there is humid day, it should be lower. Or if it is hot day, it should be higher. But we will stay later. <laughs>